Hey folks, hope you're doing good today. Now I've got a bit of a mixed bag for you today. Three bands. Uh, they're all roughly kind of from the hardcore metalcore area. Something like that. Uh, but it's going to be three good bands by the sound of things. So we'll get straight into it. This first band is called From Ash to Stone, which is a pretty cool name. And this one's called Into the Abyss. So let's check it out. <laughs> Nice. Good guitar sound, I like the vocal, good drum sound, everything's nice and loud in the mix. Let's listen out for the bass. You can hear the bass, but it's not really got its own tone. I spoke about that every video. Yeah, good drum sound though, nice snare hits. Good guitar in. Lots of vocal layering to make it nice and thick. But you can hear the bass. I did hear the bass there with this slide. You could just put another couple of decibels on the bass. Just to beef it up even more. Yeah, these guys are nice. Heavy drawn out, got that arpeggio stuff to fill out the higher end, nice. Yeah, you can hear the bass now, that's got a nice sound, just wants to be a bit louder, that would be all I'd say. Nice, drums sound good. Vocal's nice as well, I like the vocal. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, good sound to this band. Yeah, there's parts in the song where you can hear the bass nicely and then other parts it just gets a little bit drowned out by the guitars because guitars are nice and loud, nice and big. Yeah. These guys like to break it down as well into the chugs. Good washy cymbals for these parts so. this track good guitar tone good gravel in his vocal natural they haven't put a lot of effects on his voice there's no distortion and all that stuff on there, that's just natural gravel in his throat. Good. Heavy. Enjoyed that one. Uh, yeah, that was that was just heavy as you like, pretty much. Uh, if they'd have just cranked the bass up a couple more notches, that would have been, you know, I would have had nothing bad to say about it whatsoever. Not that I'm saying bad things about it. Look. Uh, I've got a nitpick on every track really because every track that we get has got something good to offer and you know I've got to just run through all the instruments to try and nitpick have you done this right yet have you done this right yet all right well just turn the bass up a bit more is pretty much all I could say about that one so yeah nice track good vibe 
everything was good. And so keep sending us your music. Like this next band have, we've had this band on the channel before, Quantum Drop Love. Now these guys are a bit, uh, you know, not as pounding as the last band, I don't think. Um, but all the bands today are very modern. Uh, uh, yesterday we had the old school guys, and today we've got the modern younger guys uh, doing their thing as well. So yeah, let's check out Quantum Drop Love, and this track's called Eventually. I was saying modern music, I've said this before, the modern guys, they seem to have turned down the distortion a little bit, they're a little bit more crunchy, they like their twiddly widdly widdly riffs, a bit more jazz influence I would say is where it's come from, we've got the vocal layering and I've spoke about it many times with these higher range guys that it's good to have a good bit of vocal layering because it thickens it up nicely. This track's not quite as in your face as the last one, but it's not meant to be. Good washy cymbals still. The whole mix is a bit quieter than the last band. I think they could have gone away with pumping this one a little bit louder. Just the overall mix. Good drumming. It's a nice guitar tone, as I say, it's just rolled back on the gain, more crunchy than distorted so that you can get those twiddly woodly riffs to come through a bit more. You can hear the bass in the mix. Yeah, these kind of riffs. got that kind of um, pop punk vibe to this track. I think the other track was a bit different to this one. This one's got that energy in it, you know, that kind of uh, punky energy. Um, you can imagine playing the burnout games to this kind of song, you know, it's that kind of vibe. Yeah, everything sits nicely in the mix in this one. I can hear all the elements of the music, all the different instruments, uh, but my only kind of pickup would be that it could just be a bit louder overall when you compare it to the, to the loudness of the last band. You know, these guys have got a lot more headroom that they could have filled up with volume. Not sure though, this, I think this is one of those quarantine ones where they've made the track individually at home and then someone's mixed it all together and they've done the vids and everything we've seen a lot of those vids obviously because that's all that's available at the moment um, some of them are better than others I'd say this has come out better than some of the others I've heard um, some of them you know the, <laughs> sounds like it's their first mix this doesn't sound like that this certainly doesn't sound like a first mix Yeah, nice energy to this part, picks up nicely, goes with the vocal. Nice. And when you consider what I've just said, that you know these guys have knocked that out while they're all at home. Uh, just now recording themselves on a webcam and all of that stuff and then mixing it down. Looks like they've done that all themselves because they had their DAWs open in the videos. Let me just stop that. Um, so yeah, very, very nice. Just shows you can knock out some good music even while you're locked indoors. Keep sending us your music and we'll have you on the channel again. That goes for all the bands. Right, this last band is called The Fractured and the track is called Dirt Nap. There's a fly buzzing around me. Dirt Nap, I like the name of that, so let's check this one out. Yeah. Oh yeah, this one's a guitar playthrough. Yeah. Modern T. 
Toad. Nice. Modern riffage. Listen to those drums. They got some reverb on them. New metal here as well, that riff. Yeah. Really washy cymbals on the drums. Nice drumming as well. You can hear the bass in the mix. I don't know if we're going to get any vocal on this one. Good guitar tone. Nice and thick. Good riffage. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure I've heard riffs like this out of some new metal bands. It's got a good kind of hip hop energy to it. Nice. Doing a few different things on the guitar. Riffage, rhythm guitar. Nice. Nice mix as well. Everything's sticking nicely in the mix. It's nice and loud. Symbols have got a really nice wash to the high end. They don't interfere with the guitars and all of that. Yeah. Can't go wrong with that riff. Nice. You can hear the different influences that this guy has had in his guitar and for sure. I'm sure he listens to some mid-2000s to late-2000s metalcore and stuff like that. Bit of new metal's in there, so yeah, he's got a nice style. Modern, as I said. These are what the new guys sound like. Nice chords. Good rhythm. No, we've got no vocal or anything, but the guitar's holding the interest. It's not doesn't sound boring or just waiting for him to get to the next riff. Good. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed that playthrough of Dirt We Map. enjoyed it. If you happen to like that song as well, then give a listen to our new EP, Ten Swords, available on all streaming services and YouTube. For more Fractured content, you can follow us on social media or subscribe and turn on notifications to this channel. Well, we'll be doing that. We'll be doing that. So yeah, you got a new album out. You can pick that up. Um, good stuff. I enjoyed that one. Nice modern tone, thick guitar, good riffage. Good drums, good washy cymbals. Um, so yeah, had all the elements that came together nicely there. Uh, we didn't hear the vocal on this one, so if you do another video with a, you know with a full motion video uh, with the vocals on there, send that in because we want to hear that. If there is vocals, uh, I'm not sure if there is or not. If I'm quite honest, but I'm going to presume that there is, and if there is. We want to hear it, uh, but we want to hear more of all the bands that we've had on today. That was three nice bands, heavy bands, uh, all with something different to offer as well. Um, and these are all pretty new tracks, I think. So this is fresh music. Good stuff. Hope you enjoyed that, guys. We'll have something different for you tomorrow. Uh, but that's going to be it for today. See you around. Bye.